All right, guys, I'm excited to show you this house. It is a older house that holds historical value. It's not on the historical registry, but does hold historical value. This is the front street right here that we're looking at, covered front porch, all the original brick. It's all, most of it's been freshly painted on the outside here. Side porch, and there is a back porch as well, and a hard to find two car garage with this as well. And the location on this one, this is on the north side of Miamisburg here. Guys, we're just a couple blocks away from downtown, old downtown Miamisburg. Um, literally, I mean, just a couple blocks away and the river's just a, a hop, skip and a jump over there as well. Tons of updates on the inside the house. Mechanically, it's newer. We have a brand new furnace, brand new air conditioner. The kitchen was gutted, completely redone. The bathroom was gutted and completely redone. All of the flooring is new, but it still has like the original doors and trim and windows for the most part, just about everywhere. So it still has that historical charm and character that most people are looking for in a house, but with the modern updates and conveniences. And again, two car garage. I'm gonna shut the camera off and we're gonna go check out the backyard and the back porch, and then we'll go inside and take a look. I'll meet you in the backyard. All right, so here it just came out the back door. The yard is completely fenced in. We have a six foot privacy fence all the way around. Have a little old frame of a pergola or gazebo there. Fire pit, then access to our two car garage. And again, the roof on the house and the garage are newer. And you actually can't really see, but flowers are starting to pop up over there, it looks like. And right here as well. So it's winter time when we're shooting this video. So in the springtime, it looks a lot better back here. Next, that's the back door right there, but we're not gonna go in there. Next, I'm gonna go in the side door. Actually, we'll go in the front door. We're gonna show you the inside. I'll meet you in there. All right, so here I just walked through the front door and we walk into the living room here. One thing I like about this is huge windows that go all the way up and original trim. We got a little light stuff going on here, but original trim and looks like a lot of original wood windows. All the flooring has been updated, uh, light fixtures, fireplace here. This is currently inoperable, as are most of the fireplaces in this age, but very high ceilings. I'd say these are probably nine or 10 foot ceilings. All new flooring, fresh coat of paint. And we're gonna go this way next, but right now we're gonna go here. This is the family room here. Again, older inoperable fireplace. And another door here too, looks like original door also. And this is the front porch where we come in. So you can have two front doors. And then over here, this goes down to the basement and this goes upstairs. And we actually have a second set of staircases that go upstairs and downstairs as well. So walking in here, I think we're gonna call this the dining room. And here's the side door. If you're looking at the house in person, this is the door that you'll be coming through here. And here's our second staircase going upstairs. We'll check that out here in a minute, but a huge dining room. And we do have a first floor bedroom here. I love that door. Very tall, it's probably a seven plus foot door right there, solid wood. So this is the first floor bedroom. This is on the back right of the home. All new flooring, fresh coat of paint, new light fixture in here as well. And then straight across, that's the front door. Then coming into the kitchen, we have all new, I, I, this is ceramic or porcelain, I'm not sure. New back door going out to the back porch. Kitchen, everything in here is new. Um, actually, the fridge is newer, but everything else is new. All of the shelves stay, all of the appliances stay. All stainless steel, and these are 42 inch oversized cabinets. Huge farm sink with a very nice faucet that overlooks the backyard. You can see the fire pit right there. And then there's still a few more things to see on the first floor here. We have a closet over here to the left, and we do have a full bathroom here. Now this is new pretty much from the studs in. Brand new vanity, and that's a cool vanity right there. Ceramic tile in here, a new tub and tile, and then the toilet is over here to the right. And then we have first floor laundry as well. New ceramic in here. And then a double closet. You could put shelves in there to your liking. Now, 
Um, the second set of stairs to the basement was around the corner, right here. And not gonna go down there because it's a basement. There's a huge amount of storage in there. And we have a new furnace down there. And like I said, tons of storage. But next, I'm gonna meet you upstairs. All right, so here I just came up these stairs. And again, there's two staircases to get up here. But we come up here, this is a great little office area. Really, it could be a kid's room, nursery, workout room, all kinds of different possibilities here. Closet over here, built-in shelves, and then we have our full bathroom right here. New vanity, new toilet, and look at this, a clawfoot tub right here. Very, very cool. All new ceramic tile in here as well. All the flooring up here is new. And we have three bedrooms up here to check out. And that little office area that I called, that is not one of them, but look at this bedroom. It is massive. We do have an overhead ceiling fan here with a switch in the wall. All new flooring in here. And then there's our closet. And I love this original doors and trim on here. And coming down the hallway, this is a lot bigger than what it looks. This is that second staircase to come up here. This would be the ultimate hide and go seek house. The kids would go crazy having two staircases. And another bedroom again, huge door. This is on the, this is in the middle of the house on the right side. So those windows would overlook the driveway. And then this is on the back right of the house. This is our fourth bedroom here. New ceiling fan that's on a switch. And this one overlooks the driveway from that window. And then the garage and the backyard from this window. So up here, three generously sized bedrooms, a second full bathroom, and nothing to do but move in and enjoy yourself. Next, I'm gonna meet you downstairs for a few closing statements. Get you another view of the bathroom while we're up here. Very cool. Brand new, that's a nice vanity. Okay, sorry, I'll meet you downstairs. So thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions about this home or if you'd like to see it in person, feel free to give me a call or give your realtor a call. I'm sure they'd be happy to show you this fine home. Guys, a historical home like this that has the history and the old charm, but the modern updates and conveniences. And again, we're just a couple blocks from old downtown Miamisburg with the eateries and just a couple blocks away from the river has great walkability score, and this would be a wonderful place to call home. Just get your final personal touches on it and call this home. This isn't gonna last long, so give us a call. We look forward to talking to you.